What's up guys, today on All Sports Central we're we'll going to be going over a final preview on the Kansas City Chiefs. Now this was a team last season that did really well and I really surprised you. I think this was going to be a team that was going to be kind of towards the bottom of the AFC. I mean because you got a really young quarterback in Pat Mahomes, very little experience. This team really surprised me last season. They ended up going to the AFC, AFC Championship game. I really believe that they could make it to the Super Bowl and possibly even win it. That would have been crazy as well. But how are they going to do in 2019 is what we're going to be going over today. Kansas City Chiefs 2019 predictions. They went 12-4 in 2018 for the regular season. And they lost in the AFC Championship to the New England Patriots. Um, it, was definitely, it was definitely a crazy season for this team. I'm sure the fans really didn't expect it either. But when they got rid of Alex Smith and they had Pat Mahomes, I didn't know if they knew what they were doing. Uh, but they sure did because Pat Mahomes has been a great quarterback. I think he's going to be... Probably top three for quarterbacks this season. He did very well last year. Once again, yeah, he's in his breakout 2018 season, but there's no more Kareem Hunt for this team. He is gone, of course, due to that incident last season. Um, how is this going to impact the team, though? I mean, they do. They still have running backs. Um, the thing is, though, I think that may be a little bit of a weak spot for the Chiefs this season. Um, but so it's gonna be, they're going to have to rely on Pat Mahomes a little bit more in this season. They do still have Tyreek Hill. Uh, he's it's depending on if he's healthy, then that's really going to help this team. But he definitely does need to stay healthy. But Sammy Watkins, he's another one of their key receivers for next season. They're really going to need them um, if their running back situation continues to be the way that it is. Another Super Bowl run in 2019. I really do believe that this Chiefs team is going to go for it. I think they're going to make it. I really do believe that the Chiefs, I mean, I got my NFL playoff predictions coming up soon. Um, I'll release that for you eventually. But I do have the Chiefs in the Super Bowl. This is going to be a team that's going to be dangerous, and I really do believe that they've got a great shot at it. I mean, if their defense can do well, then that's also really going to help this team. I mean, part of it's the offense, but also part of it is the defense. Now looking at their schedule, here's what you've got. I think they're going to go on a roll to start off the season. I've got them winning uh, 10 straight games, 10 of their first games all the way until November 18th when you have to go to Los Angeles to play the Chargers. That will be your first loss there. Uh, but st speaking of the first 10 games though, Jaguars, Raiders, you got two road games to start off the season. That's kind of interesting there. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. Maybe they will drop one of those games. If they drop any one of them though, I could be the Raiders one actually because they probably sleep on that one if so. And also, also the second road game to start off the season. But I'm going to give them a win there. Raiders, I don't really expect to be. I mean, they'll be better this season, but they still won't be great. Ravens, then, they'll be a tough one. They're going to win that at home. And you got Lions, they'll be a win. Colts will be another tough game. But I also have that winning just because it's an arrowhead. Texans, once again, another AFC opponent. It's going to be tough. Broncos on the road. Packers at home. That Packers game will be interesting as well. By selling the Chiefs get the win there. Vikings at home. Titans on the road. Those two will both be wins as well. So I think they're going to be on a roll going into this Chargers game. Then they drop this one because it's a road game. And then you got the Raiders at home. They're going to pick it back up there. But then you lose to the Patriots on the road the next week. I think the Patriots are going to really want that game. Well, of course, both teams are really going to want that game. But with it being where the Patriots are and it's in December, so it's probably going to be really chilly there, as it always is. And the Chiefs might not be used to that. Who knows? But I think the Patriots win that one. Broncos then on December 15th will be a win and then he kind of dropped another one against the Bears on the road And I talked about that game in my Bears prediction. I mean, that's gonna be a tough one as well I think the Bears, I mean, they're gonna be coming off of a couple of big wins there I think the Bears are gonna be on a roll. They win that one at home. Then you got the Chargers at home You really have to win this game uh, to secure that number one position in the AFC But I think at this point even though that game may not make much of a difference. I'm not so sure yet uh, if they've already, if they would have already considered or gotten that first round by, but you gotta win that Chargers game. They win it. So record stats five and one against the division, ten and two against the AFC. They go undefeated at home in 2019, and also they've got a five and three record for away games. Record prediction: 13 and three overall for the Chiefs during the regular season. What do you guys think of this team? Let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments below. Uh, will be an interesting team. I do expect them to be right towards the top for the majority of the season. They're going to be a dangerous one for sure. With I mean, Arrowhead is a very tough place to play. We've seen that. It's kind of a stunner to see the Patriots even win in that AFC Championship game. But 
Anyway, once again, let me know your guys' thoughts, guys. Uh, more NFL predictions coming soon over the next few weeks. So stay tuned for more from ASC.